Here's the rest of our excursion train. We're now going eastbound into Newark, Ohio. So now we're taking the right hand passing track. A couple rail fans alongside the rail. Oh, this is where the uh, Newark Heath local uh, switches out their cars. Um, that was an old Penn Central line that connected up to this uh, Pennsylvania Railroad right of way. And that Penn Central line that you see going to the left actually went down the Thurston at one time, went there via uh, Millersport. Triple track, just look at that. There's another track on the right side. The line we're riding on here is former Pennsylvania Railroad Panhandle trackage. Nothing like seeing old camo trucks. I don't know where that's at. That's where the ice cream shop is at. I think that's the same place I was there. Oh, I just mentioned uh, my my grandma Rita actually lived in Newark, Ohio. So that's that's why that road looks so familiar. I just overheard my uh, grandma Rita Diebold was my dad's mom. And her husband, uh, Charlie, used to work for the Baltimore and Ohio back in the day as a dispatcher in Newark Yard. Port, I think if I'm correct, portion of that track was the, uh, uh, there was some B&O right-of-way, so they had a Newark division um, that also ran from uh, Newark all the way up to Zanesville. I'll have to check back my history book sometime. There's some switches that got taken out. Now this area definitely looks familiar. 21st Street. 21st Street. I remember videotaping. Uh, it was an east. It was an eastbound. It was, a, it was an eastbound train that I videotaped here the day before Christmas Eve. Uh, 
there was a chair that got left on the tracks. I don't know how it got there. The dumb bunnies. Okay, my dad made a reference to the Dave Pilkey book, uh, The Dumb Bunnies. You probably are probably familiar with it. Oh. There's the Ever Road Crossing where I videotaped Ohio Central a few times last summer. And just as a friendly reminder, trains are fun to watch, but please don't put a chair on the train tracks. Safety first. Okay, this place looks familiar. This is Pine Street. And sad part is the double track is no longer utilized. It's just a single track. Goes to show you that corporate has taken over a portion of this once proud historical house, um, Pennsylvania Railroad panhandle line. So what you're watching here is some nostalgia from America's past.